is supposed to launch next year with a test machine, that will fly around the moon. It's not going to stop at the moon, it's going to swing around and then swing around and come home after a few weeks. So technically that will reach the moon first. But Starship, um, I mean, Elon Musk is moving very fast with that, and was, I won't be surprised if he uh, if flies test flights with that to space or to low altitude before uh, SLS flies. He might even get to orbit before uh, the Artemis program puts people on the moon. He might even get to the moon before then. Uh, I, I, it's a huge, radical redesign, and there are a lot of unknowns. And it's entirely, I find it entirely likely that they make another big radical change that pushes out their timeline. I think it's marvelous that there's a race at all, and many people think that there's no chance of, of this going uh, into the 20-24 deadline, but uh, it's, it's all in play as far as I'm concerned. And uh, I wish everyone involved best of luck in getting back to you, because that's really what matters to me. Scott, despite some uh, uh, unpredicted technical glitches in a, a short time, thank you very much for an excellent presentation. A big hand for Scott.